Hello everybody, I am Dr. Pallavi Aga. I am a doctor and I am a lifestyle consultant. Carbohydrates. This is a very crucial topic and everybody is talking about carbohydrates. Lene hai, nahi lene hai, kitne lene hai, kaise lene hai, kyo lene hai. There are a lot of debates going about uh, on everywhere on social media. Everybody is discussing this that carbohydrates are they the enemy, are they not the enemy. So let me break all myths about carbohydrates. Number one, carbohydrates are really not that essential form of macronutrients. Carbohydrates humko kya karte hai? Carbohydrates humko energy dete hai. But we have to understand that excess amount of energy jab hume carbohydrates se milti hai, then hamara it jo pancreas insulin secrete karta hai, wo constantly on a higher level hota hai. Aur uske wajay se ultimately excess carbohydrates will ultimately lead into an increased insulin and ultimately over a period of 10 years, 15 years, it will lead to diabetes, hypertension and lot of other lifestyle problems and also gaining weight very gaining weight slowly and steadily over the years diabetes and hypertension are all very chronic slowly progressive diseases so we don't immediately feel it but ultimately that is what happens when we are taking in too much of carbohydrates ab carbohydrates ka advantage kaha aata hai some amount of carbohydrates are perfectly fine, especially in, uh, in, in women, in perimenopausal, menopausal women. And in those who are extremely active, in those who are runners and they are doing long endurance runs, in those who are doing a lot of workouts, those are the people who can safely add some amount of carbohydrates to their diet, keeping in mind that the protein content should not go down. So, According to your fitness level, according to your activity level, you have to play around with either adding carbs or fats to your diet because both carbohydrates and fats give us energy. Carbohydrates give us gives us sudden energy and fats give us slow energy. That's the main difference between the two that they both of us give both of these things give us energy. So now what is the good time to add carbohydrates? You'll be surprised to know that the good time to add carbohydrates is during your last meal of the day, which always should be an early meal. So the last meal, the dinner when you take, that is the time when you can add your carbohydrates in the forms of lentils, which also has protein and carbs, legumes, again protein and carbs, or some amount of root vegetables like a couple of you know carrots, beetroots, one uh, potato, one uh, uh, sweet potato, some amount of millets, some amount of uh, ragi, jowar, any of these things, besan, chila, moong dal, chila, these are all good sources of complex carbs. Not more than that, enough, that amount of carbs which you have in your plate at night is very, it's sufficient enough. What it will do, it will aid to good quality sleep at night. Also, it will be stored as glycogen and it will help you in your morning workouts, in your morning runs, in uh, all the other activities you do in the morning so that you can very very uh, nicely do your intermittent fasting and you have no issues so that is where the role of carbohydrates come in carbohydrates is not really the enemy as we have been i mean everybody even thinks uh, that i also all the time say that carbs are the enemy i have made it a point that please understand it's the excess amount of carbohydrates which are the enemy and I keep emphasizing on the fact that please make protein the main component of your balanced diet. Balanced diet means that your plate should have more of protein, good amount, some amount of fat and some amount of carbohydrates as per your fitness level and as per your metabolic health. If your metabolic health is fine, if you are a lean person, if you are working out sufficient, you can afford to add some amount of carbohydrates in your diet. If you're looking into losing weight, then please try to go as low on carbs as would be helpful or beneficial to you. So that is where the role of carbs come in. I hope I have made all of you very, very clear. Also one word of caution, carbohydrate and protein, excellent combination. 
protein and fat excellent combination but as soon as you just add the toxic combination of fat and carbohydrate like a fried samosa like a fried jalebi like all your uh, vegetable vegetarian momos all that other fried uh, batashe uh, kachori puri all of these indian junk food or the um, the packaged junk food that is when it really will harm your metabolic health so avoid a toxic combination of fats plus carbs and fry because that is something which is very harmful please understand the health we are building up today will be reflected almost 10 years later on because the metabolic diseases like diabetes hypertension thyroid are slowly progressive diseases you may feel you are perfectly fine right now but maybe 10 years later from now if you are living on a high carbohydrate diet in spite of doing all your workouts you are running you will land into trouble so target your carbohydrates carbohydrates are not essential they have to be targeted they have to be targeted according to your metabolic health and according to your fitness level that is something which is extremely important and has to be understood by everybody those who wish to uh, contact me for professional consultations i would be very happy to do so do whatsapp to me or email to me thank you very much i hope you have understood everything about carbohydrates i hope you like this video do like subscribe and share